right off the get go to the top 15 second autonomous period. We got two red robots moving and a third one scoring as well. On the red side, we got teams trying to score. 1700 got bounced. That was well as 115 on the loose when the red side got scored out. Right out of the get go, hard hit from 1700 and 115 on each alliance. Just a hard hit in the middle. We'll see what happens as they pass by each other. They avoid each other. Thirty-two fifty-six. That's the Warrior Borg scoring a cone on the high node. The higher the piece is scored, the more points it's worth. Middle of the field. We got some hard defense being played by eighty-seven fifty-six. That's Magic Valley Logic Control slowing down the Blue Alliance from running back and forth from their player stations. Just trying to slow them down as much as possible. The Gator Botics, Robot 1700, looks like they are dragging something across the field. Not sure exactly what they have dragging behind them, but doesn't seem to be affecting them as of now. Thirty-two sixteen. that's Missoula Robotics. Sounds like they're having a little bit of trouble with their robots, so they've resulted to playing defense, slowing down the red team as much as possible. Kind of an interesting strategy coming from 8756, as they seem to be playing defense against the defense bots just to allow their teammates to keep going across the field as fast as possible. Thirty-two forty-five. Team Ravens over in their player area, receiving a cone from one of their players to try and score it with thirty seconds to go. With less than twenty seconds, we're gonna see teams start jumping up on top of their charge stations. The more the robots, the more the points they'll earn. As the Blue Alliance has two robots, they barely just met out in the last second. Team 115, though, however, get one last. With a final score of 90 to 76, that's going to reward the Red Alliance with two ranking points. Congratulations to all the teams.